Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of the video, this is going to be a fun vlog. I am starting this on Friday, July 12th and I'm gonna be vlogging this weekend. I have two concerts this weekend, but right now I am actually headed to a book signing for Lauren Roberts. If you guys don't know who Lauren Roberts is, she is the incredible author of one of my favorite books of all time, Reckless, or Powerless. There's a neighbor coming by. That was really awkward. I don't think he realized that I had the camera up there though. I'm waiting until he drives away. All right, we're back. We're back and we're Ruben. Lauren Roberts is the author of Powerless and also Reckless now because the sequel it has just come out. But she's the author of Powerless, which has become one of my favorite books of all time. I live in Arizona, so I'm headed to Tempe right now to go to the book signing, which is like an hour away. So I really need to get going because I want to be there like a couple minutes before check-in time so I can hopefully be one of the first people so I can leave and go home because it is really far. Also, I put contacts in today and I'm kind of regretting my decision. I feel like I look really bizarre, but it's fine. Anyway, you can bring two extra books. So I brought uh, Powerless and Powerful, of course, so that I can get my whole little collection signed. And I am really excited. I did buy the package that has like the little like Q&A talking about the book section first. So yeah, we're gonna get going, we're gonna get driving, and we're gonna go to Changing Hands in Tempe. It's so exciting and cool for me, it's such an honor. Also, props to all of you for living in a literal oven. <laughs> like, I am from Michigan. This is the hottest I've ever been and the hottest I ever plan on being. So, one of my lovely editors, and they, I will never leave them alone. Like, literally every day I'm talking to them. They're so incredible. And I was like, do you think they're gonna like it? Like, I don't know if it's good. And she said something to me that was so pretty. I was like, honestly, you should be the one writing books. Um, she was like, Lauren, each of these books have a different heartbeat and powerless is very much like up and down back and forth like all over the place very intense she's like but reckless it's more of like a linear incline if you will and it's very much again Peyton and Kai's story and their journey and it, it needed to happen in order to step into book three guys it is now saturday july 13th and i am getting ready to head out to book club but i did want to update you guys about the book signing last night i didn't talk after i ended up leaving because it was like a really long drive home it was like almost an hour and so i drove home and then honestly i just read for my book club and went to bed i have book club today at 11 to like probably like 12 12 30 ish and then tonight i have the band camino concert so i'll be vlogging that as well but I wanted to show you guys what I bought at the bookstore and the books that I got signed. So for the signing, I don't know if I told you guys, but you got a copy of Reckless and then you could bring your Powerless and Powerful copies to get signed as well. And she was so freaking sweet and just genuinely so kind. She personalized this one for me. And honestly, I the line was going really, really fast. So you literally got like 45 seconds if that to talk to her but I was just like I really love your writing your writing has brought me back into reading so much and love you you're gorgeous and then she called me pretty so that was really sweet um but she is literally stunning in real life like I knew that she was pretty because I follow her on Instagram TikTok and all of that stuff but Lauren Roberts is literally gorgeous and she's smart like are you kidding me anyways we have these here anyways we have these here then I walked around the store a little bit and I did buy a couple of things, nothing super crazy, but I did buy a copy of The Great Gatsby. This is for 
potentially a future video that I might film, but also I just honestly wanted this <laughs> I don't know if y'all hear, heard that, but I think my cat just knocked something down. So hold on. Okay. It was nothing serious. Anyway, read this book in high school, literally loved it, still love it, love the movie. Just wanted a copy for my personal collection. This isn't my favorite cover that I've ever seen of The Great Gatsby, but it was $6 and I was like, that's the cheapest I've ever seen the book, so I'm gonna get it. So I have that and then I bought some stickers for my Kindle. So what I had on my Kindle before, I'll show you guys. I totally forgot to like take a picture of my Kindle before. I might have one somewhere in the archives, but these are the stickers that I had on my Kindle before. So I had books join the club with these little like cats. I had Lizzie McGuire, of course, because Duh. I had just one more chapter. This is like a super cute little one. And then I had It's Me, Hi, I'm the Problem, It's Me, because Swifty, duh. And then I had this little heart that's like a little bookcase. And these are the stickers that I bought last night for my Kindle. So obviously like everything doesn't fit super perfect, but I like it to be like a little bit of a collage. So I have the book was better on these little movie tickets. I have a little spicy romance book. I have a cat that says I'm all booked. A camera because obviously. And then Reading is Magic. This one is kind of cute. I thought it reminded me of this Just One More Chapter one, so I kind of wanted to keep that theme. And then I bought an additional sticker that is, okay, focus, hello. I bought an additional sticker that says, the time spent with books and cats is never wasted because I thought this was really cute. So that's what I bought from the bookstore and I am headed to book club now. I'll see if I can get any like little clips while I'm there. I don't really want to subject anyone to being in my video because like I also don't know everyone super well well one of my best friends is there but anyway this is the Kindle she's cute and I love my little pop socket I got from Target but yeah I am going to go ahead and head to book club and I will see you guys on the other side <laughs> All right guys, it is a couple hours later. I have been home for a little bit. I actually went through my closet today and got rid of so much stuff, um, but I'm gonna deal with that on Monday because this weekend's really busy. I am about to head over to my friend Kayla's house. We are going to the band Camino concert together and I am pretty much ready to go. I do plan on taking my camera because my phone has like literally no storage and I didn't have time to clear my storage to be honest so I will be vlogging with my camera I'm pretty sure also you guys don't know this but we got another cat his name is Vader like Darth Vader say hello <laughs> but I just did a little like basic makeup look I literally just did eyeliner like that's really the only thing I did. I'm wearing a black tank top and some Abercrombie shorts. Here, let me see if I could do like a full fit check. This is the outfit. <laughs> I don't even know what shoes I'm gonna wear yet, but I honestly, I didn't vlog getting ready because every time I vlog getting ready, y'all skip through it. So you didn't get it this time. Anyway, I'm gonna head out. <laughs> We're at the concert and I honestly feel really uncomfortable vlogging so I'm probably not going to talk very much but we're here. Okay, we're out of the concert and look what Kayla got. The set list. Is she cute? Wins only for us. Yes. <laughs> now I think we're gonna go to IHOP, so wait. Yeah, girl. I'm Cause starving. I'm starving, I'm, so I we're gonna go to IHOP. And I'll talk about the concert later when I get home. Hey guys, it's Sunday, July 14th. And today is the Tate McRae concert. I did really light makeup today. I honestly, I just didn't feel like caking on makeup. And that's the tea. As for the outfit, everything is from Hollister, but I have this like, 
I don't even know, sporty top on and these like track pants. Anyway, my friend Zaya is going to the concert with me today and my friend Kayla that you guys saw yesterday and my friend Jacob are also going to the concert. So afterwards, we're all gonna meet up and go to Raising Cane's for like a late dinner. So y'all will see them later in the vlog, but it is 524, so we're about to like head out towards the venue. The doors open at 630, but we wanna take pictures and stuff, so that's what's going on. Anyways, that is the look for today. Just some silver jewelry. I have a 444 necklace and some little like square hoops almost on my ears. And I think the shoes that I'm gonna wear are going to be like high top, chunky black Converse because I wanna be comfortable and I honestly don't wanna have to deal with anything else. I'm exhausted today, so that's why I didn't vlog anything else today. I honestly, I went to brunch with some friends and then we went to Barnes, but I didn't buy any books or anything. And I was with people that like, I've never hung out with before. So I wasn't gonna vlog because like, I don't know, I just felt like that was kind of rude. Anyways, I am about to head out. I need to clear some phone storage, so I need to do that now. <laughs> Wait, look, oh, I zoomed in. Um, come here. <laughs> okay. Zaya, Jacob, say hi. Hi, Bob. Hi. <laughs> Song. So uh, this one's called Calgary. Yeah. Oh, no. 